welcome back. I'm doing a little film about underpainting. I use Contem, a British product, and Nano Colors from Scarva. Both of these are great products, and there's not a lot of difference between the quality at all in them. The biggest mistake beginners make is not using enough water. You've got to use a lot of water. You don't want it transparent, but you've got to make sure it's a very thin layer. Otherwise it flakes off when you put the glaze on or it melts with the glaze and you get a horrible scrabbly bit in the bottom. So I'm not going to talk too much. Let's get on with it and let's see if you enjoy how I paint and what I'm doing. So we've got we've got a wheel, a nice old one of my old metal turntables really, and it's it's very nice flow. Older they are, usually the better they're made. And I put a little face cloth. Came from a very nice hotel this kid. And that's where the jug goes. So that's where I'm gonna do my painting. I'll orientate it a little bit better so you can see exactly what's going on as I'm doing it but that's going to be the area so that I can see exactly what's going on. Now, after you wash it, you sometimes see a few bits here, like a little bit of crack over here. I'm going to sand that out quickly, and then I'm going to start doing some drawing on the side and then some painting.
Let's have a look. Should be nice and cold now. Okay, there she is. She turned out better than expected. That makes a change. Usually the phrase Potter's uses, worse than expected. Not as good, not what I expected, but I'm very happy with that. So get some nice pitch in a minute and off we go.